Welcome back guys Yes you are back With your boy Scarcious We are in the Master League right now Still got our feet up here We're chilling you know Faced up against the Dialco We have our Mewtwo on the lead We built up We're baiting that we have Focus Blast Will they fall for it? Let's see Nope, they let it go, it's fine with us, building up, they're going to get to our iron head around about now, they do. I'm going to shield this up. And then we're going to keep building up. Build up, build up and let off another side strike. Let's see if they decide to shield this. We will have another one ready not too long after. Yep. Yeah. And there it is. Do they want to let their DL go down? Or are they going to shield? Did they let it go? Okay, fine with us. And then they come in with their me too. I'm going to let off this side strike straight away. They should know it's a side strike. But they shield it. Okay, that's fine with us. We win CMP, of course. We are best buddy Hundo. Okay. And we're coming now with our Zekron. What's it going to be? Are we going to catch this? Yeah, we do. <laughs> you see, when you know your accounts, yeah? You can do this. Nice, let's go. Let's go. He must be upset right now. Or should I say she? If it's a female trainer with a female character there. Uh, is this gonna be a shadow ball? We're not gonna shield. Is this a shadow ball now? No, it's a flamethrower. What? Okay. Okay, that's fine with us. Okay. That's my first time coming across a Mewtwo with flamethrower. Probably trying to hit up them steel types, trying to catch them steel types out. Fair play. We definitely weren't going to shield anything coming from the meter at that point, so we wouldn't even have got caught out there anyway. Okay, are we shielding this up? No, we let it go. It's fine. We want to save the shield for Zacrom. Hopefully, we can get a defense drop here. Oh, they showed that. Yeah, that's fine with us. Definitely fine with us. Okay, so they're running wild charge. Probably go close combat now. Yeah, they do. And we showed that up. Rightfully so. Their defense has fallen now. So our next charged attack will be doing a lot more than it would have normally. They buffed themselves again. And we knew they were going to try and swap, so we didn't throw any move. We were aware of that. And now, the comes back in. Uh, he cleared his debuff, though. But, yeah, let's see how much this does. Nicely done. Takes down the Zacian. And that's a GG. You know the vibes. Let's go. Let's go. You aren't going to catch on me. We stay ready. <laughs> All right, next one. Oh, faced up against a Garchomp here, yeah? You know we got that beam on deck. We got that beam, yo. So we're going to have to see if they decide to shield this. You know the beam catches out a lot of trainers. Let's see if it does now. Why, yo, get wrecked. <laughs> Next one, he comes in Metagross now. Okay, so they would know that I haven't got Shadow Ball now. Because there's no way I run Shadow Ball or Ice Beam them in it, so. But there's probably someone out there who is doing something like that, but not me. And he decides to shield anyway. <laughs> okay, maybe, maybe they thought I was one of them trainers who would run Shadow Ball and Ice Beam, I guess. But we'll take that, they decide to shield. I'm cool with that. 
Are they going for a full farm down? We're gonna get to another charge move now because they want to go for that full farm down. Fair play. So they're gonna come up with two meteor mashes after this. But we're just chipping away at them and they just had to swap out now. Which is fine with us. So we came in Zekrom now. And they're gonna be chipping away at us with bicycle spear, that's for sure. But that's fine. Because we're gonna build up and we're gonna go for the wild charge and get their last shield and remain holding two shields with a full Luger in the back. <laughs> so I would say we're still in the driver's seat. Are we gonna be able to, oh, I was about to say, are we gonna be able to get to another charge move? They decide to throw their energy here. This will take us out because we're not sure then. Okay, so now we can come in Lugia. We've still got Mewtwo can be used for a sack swap. You know, we're gonna make another one of them well-timed catches. Okay, the ice circle spear is just tickling us. We swap out straight away and catch one of those meteor matches. We knew they had two back-to-back -back meteor matches. We catched it on Mewtwo, look at that. They've got to be upset. Got to be upset right now. And now we can just come in with Lugia. He still has two shields, so we're using one of them here. So you just preserve that health. We're gonna build up to that arrow blast. And you can't try to catch on me, man. Let's stay ready. Stay ready. We do the catching. Down goes their Metagross so and yeah. The Icicle Spears are not gonna do enough and they can't go for Earthquake because we're flying. So they're gonna go for Icicle Spears but they're gonna need quite a few of them. Cause look how much it does. We don't even show it because we know it don't do much. And then look at that. We're just gonna finish it off here, man. Did it even need to use our shield? Lugian's built bulky like that. So yeah. GD though, nicely done. And we shall take that W and move swiftly into the next one. You know that vibes. Okay, they got Melmetal on the lead. Okay. You know what we do in these situations? We're gonna like. We're gonna front and bait as if we've got focus blast and see if we can get a shield. Yeah. They should know that we just had two side, side strikes. Are they gonna shield? Yes, they do. <laughs> oh, God. These still types are shook to get one shotted. They got the flash cannon. As we know, there is quite a few. No metals going around with flash cannon now. This is gonna be a rock slide or a superpower. We're gonna to have to shield it up, of course. Superpower. They've debuffed themselves so they dip out. We're gonna throw the beam now. Okay. Are they gonna spec the beam? Oh no, they should know we got beam right now, no? No, they don't. Yeah, they wouldn't know. They wouldn't know. We haven't used the beam yet. Because they started off with nail metal. So yeah, they <laughs> they brought in their guard jump just to get one shot and sent back away. So the Melmetal comes back. <laughs> and we're just chipping away at the Melmetal with side strike. We're getting off another one here because they just want to keep farming up for some reason. Uh, maybe they just don't want to go for that super powerful to buff himself at the moment. I mean, and they're switch locked. They're trying to farm us down and get it. Okay, so we come in with a Zekrom here. This might be the superpower. Or are they gonna go for the flash cannon? They do go for the flash cannon here, which we don't mind, resisted. And now they swap out into their Zarid, which is fine with us. We're gonna come in with our Lugia, do some super effective damage with them sky attacks. Uh, they do super effective to us also, but we are built bulky with that Lugia, so we don't mind. Look at that. Look at that. 
Luke, you don't mind at all. And they do mind, so they decide to shield up, and now they have no shields. Okay, we get to another charge move here. And Lugia is still just tanking it like, why are you tickling me? But they had another charge move. So we're gonna have to shield this up. Cause we wanna get this move off and their switch clock is up and they catch. Yeah, we had to remember that the timers were misaligned but it's fine, because now we're going to swap out into our oh, Zekrom. It won't even go for a wild charge, no need, we just go for a crunch, which is resisted. But it should do the job, which it does. And that's a GG. You know the vibes. Yeah, try to catch on me to try and provide a win con for yourself, but nope. We'll still take that W and move swiftly into the next one because we know you know the vibes all right next one faced up against a growl on here okay you know we've got that beam on deck still but that beam goes straight for it and most likely won't expect it i know there you go it won't one shot but it'll do some decent damage Yep, there you go, as you can see, we could have swapped out right there and caught this Earthquake on the Lugia, but we stuck around. We thought they'll do one more fast move and then throw, but no. So we weren't able to do it, so now we're just going to stick around. And we know that this is obviously going to be a Fire Punch, so we let it go. Yep, it is that Fire Punch, of course. And now we can just farm down. And you two with a lot of energy is a bit dangerous, you know. All right, they know. We know they know that we've got the beam, so we're not going to go for it. We're going to go for the side track and potentially get a shield, which we do. So you see the mind games. Now we're going to go for the ice beam, and if they want a double shield, that is absolutely fine with us. And they let it go. Look at that damage. That is nicely done. Well played. And lucky they didn't over farm too much because we would have got another size right there. Okay, we're obviously letting this go. Need to put in work. Need to job done. Now we can come in with Zekrom, farm this down. Ooh, no way, they didn't get to use charge move. Okay, and now, uh, yeah, they must have had the charge move there with that Uvel tool, but they, it's like they knew that the game was done so they just threw the towel in and that's a GG we can move swiftly into the next one car you know that vibes okay face up against the guard shop here we have Mewtwo still on the lead of course you know it okay so we're building up you know what we do here we're gonna go for the beam and like are they gonna make the same mistake? Uh, have these trainers learned their lesson? No, they haven't. Get one shot, man. And that was the last battle. They decided to top left. GG's. Thank you guys for coming by once again. You all take care. Peace.